Are you shoppies excited to choose some extracurricular activities today? Oh, I just can't contain my excitement. Two whole classes being added to the schedule. And they both sound so fun. Ooh, some new classes are coming to Happyville High. Ooh, there's ballet class. And not just any ballet class. It's the Barely Ballet class. The shoppies can dance and twirl. They can even play some beautiful music on this giant bear piano. And then there's also this mousy art class. The shoppies can paint and draw and use their creativity to create a beautiful piece of art. These both look like super fun activities to do at school. Oh, I am definitely signing up for ballet class. I've been dancing since I could walk. I'm not much of a dancer. I think art class is the right choice for me. And besides the two new classes, there are two more surprises coming to Happyville High. Some new students to join in the fun. There's Colorissa, who definitely looks like she has a knack for art. And Skatelyn, who is one sporty and cool shoppy. Oh my goodness, I can barely handle all of this. First, we have new classes, and now new students too? What could be better? Let's start by getting our shoppies out of the boxes first. Check out how cool Miss Skatelyn is. I think my favorite part about her is her outfit. Her little dress is shaped to look like there's a skate on her skirt. It's pink and it's got wheels to make it look like an actual skate. And then she's got some yellow straps up here. And of course, she's got some skates on her feet. And I really like her hair too. It's a bright purple. And she's got it swept to the side. It just looks really pretty. And I love her eye color too. It's pink, but then it's got like a purple line on the edge. She's got some rockin' petkins too. She has a little cassette music player, which she can keep with her when she's skating. And it even looks like it has buttons on there. That way Skatelyn can turn it on and play some music. And of course she needs some headphones to go with it. Let's see if these will fit. There we go. They sorta of fit. I don't think they cover her ears all the way, but they still look very stylish. Next, let's open up Colorissa. I think it's safe to say that Colorissa is one colorful and bright shoppy. She has this bright blue hair that's swept up into a side ponytail, and her ponytail actually kind of looks like the end of a paintbrush that's been dipped in some pink paint. And she's even got a paintbrush in her hair. And then her outfit looks like it has been splattered with paint. It's just dripping all over. But it's still really cute and stylish. And then her shoes also have little paintbrushes on them. On the sides. And then I don't know if these are socks, but it looks like there's paint drips that are going up her legs. She is just covered in paint. She's even got some artsy petkins to take with her wherever she goes. She has a little yellow sketchbook and a little art class bag. She is ready for art wherever she goes. It's even got a little paintbrush on the side and some paint and maybe that's some glue. All right, well now that the new students have arrived, we can start setting up for art class and ballet class. Oh, I've never tried ballet. I'm more of a skater myself, but I really enjoy anything that keeps me moving. Maybe I'll give it a spin. Ooh, art class. I sure am glad I brought my art supplies. I am always in the mood to paint. Let's start by setting up the Barely Ballet class first. And since this is a decorator pack, there are also three surprise petkins inside. We might even find a limited edition. So our surprise petkins are in these green tiles. Let's see what our first petkin is here. We've got a little tennis racket. That's this really pretty orange color. And this must be the tennis ball holder. And the top can even come off so you can put some tennis balls inside. And here's a little tennis ball. We can just stick this down in there. It's the perfect fit. It even has a little bit of room to roll around. These definitely belong in the sporty bear gym. So the shoppies can play tennis. And here is our first petkin for the ballet class. It's the bear piano. That is adorable. It looks like an actual piano. It's got all of the keys and the little bar up here to hold the music notes. It's got the little pedals. Oh, and this can open too. Oh, that is awesome. You can totally store some stuff down in there, like music sheets. And you definitely can't play the piano without somewhere to sit. So here is a little piano stool. 
That looks really cozy, too. Aw, look at this precious little music book. I love its little pink bow. Now the shoppies have some music to read. This will go perfect on this spot up here. I love this little petkin. This is the ballet bar. I love how it has the little bows down here. The shoppies can totally use this to stretch and practice their ballet form. To go to ballet class, you definitely need some ballet slippers. And these might be the cutest ballet slippers ever. They have little bear faces. They've got the straps and these really pretty blue bows. And there's even this little blue bag that can open up. And it's the perfect place to keep the ballet slippers while the shoppies aren't using them. Here's a little bear metronome. This is definitely a very important part of ballet class. This is used to help the ballet dancers keep up with the tempo of the music. And this little blue handle will swing back and forth. Unfortunately, it does not move on the petkin. But it does have a very lovely bow on top. Ooh, check out this bear mirror. It's got its mouth in a little O shape. It's got little bows down here and these big bear ears. This is also perfect for ballet class so the ballet dancers can watch themselves in the mirror and see what they're doing. And you can't have a ballet class without some music. So here's a little bear CD player with a little bow and it's got speakers on the side and a little bear CD that we can just pop right on in the top here. And there's also this little CD case for when the shoppies are done with the CD. And it's got these little ballet slippers on it. Super cute. Ooh, I love this petkin. It's a little bear tiara with a heart in the middle. I wonder if it can actually fit on a shoppie because it can stretch a little bit here. Ooh, it sure can. That looks so cute, Angelica. It matches her pink hair and her pink outfit. And here is the last little petkin from the ballet decorator pack. It's this little bear hairbrush. All right, I think the shoppies are ready for ballet class here. There is plenty of room to practice dancing. First things first, I'm going to practice over here on the bar. I have to land the perfect pirouette. I might dance over here for a bit. I want to be able to watch myself in the mirror. Make sure I have my form down to a T. And I think I'll provide the music for today. Not only am I a skater, but I am one wicked piano player. While these shoppies are practicing in ballet class, we can set up the art class for the rest of the students. Oh, it's a little gym bag. How cute. It's an orange gym bag with some purple handles. Perfect for putting all of the stuff the shoppies need for gym class. Ooh, like this little water bottle. Beep. And a little stopwatch. Beep. Here is our very first mousy art petkin. It's an art easel. Every art class definitely needs one of these. This will be perfect to hold a canvas for the shoppies to paint on. And it's a really cool texture because it kind of looks like wood with the way it's textured and all of the little lines. And there's even a little canvas that comes with this to be able to put on the easel. Look, and it is the perfect fit. And these ears right here are really useful because it's helping hold this up. And it's already covered in paint. It's got this yellow and green paint all over. It's a bunch of squiggles, but it really looks pretty. Look, and that little squiggle up there kind of looks like its eyebrow. And check out this art table. It's kind of shaped like a paint palette, and it's got a little hole in here, which I'm assuming is for art supplies. And here's a stool for the shoppies to sit on while they're painting or coloring. I really like the little mouse faces, too, because you can see the little mouse teeth. The art class is definitely coming together. Oh, here's a little mousy box of crayons. And there's also a little box of pencils. This orange one here is stuck in the box. But this little pink one here you can actually take out. Or you can put it in this little slot right here. There is a paintbrush and a paint palette. If the shoppies would like to use paint to create a beautiful masterpiece. And in case the paint palette runs out, there's a little pink bottle of paint. The shoppies can easily just squirt some paint out here if it's running low. Look at this little mousy glue bottle. The little mousy face kind of looks like the label. And it's got ears sticking out the sides. And look, the lid can actually come off. And it looks like there's a little brush at the end. So you can get some glue on it and then just brush it all over the paper. That is so cool. I love how it can come out. It makes it look really realistic. And lastly, here is a glass jar. 
This is absolutely adorable. The shoppies can decorate this with paint, even though it's already really pretty. I love this mint green. Now it's time to get creative. Oh, look at all of these art supplies. I don't even know where to start. It has been a while since I've painted on a canvas. Usually I just pull out my sketchbook, but maybe it's time for a creative change. Ooh, pencils! My favorite drawing tool! Gosh, it's been a while since I painted anything besides my nails. Oh, I don't know what to do first! Maybe I'll start with art class. Ooh, I can paint a new banner for the gym! Oh no, but wait! I should definitely practice next week's cheer rally moves first. Oh, this is such a tough choice! Alright, well it looks like all of the shoppies have settled into their new classes, and I hope you all had one colorful blast helping me set up the art class and the ballet class. And leave me a comment in the comment section below to let me know which class you would choose. And don't forget to pirouette on over to my channel and subscribe for lots and lots more happy fun. And hopefully Rainbow Cake can decide which class she wants to go to first before they're both over. And big bear hugs and honey pots. I will see you all in another video. Bye! It's trivia time. Do you remember which shoppy had the tiara in her hair during the video? Was it Polly Polish, Pia Puzzle, Paige Pencil, or Jellica? Leave your answer below!